contest of two 10-minute rounds. popular here in Japan. Oh, as you can hear. <laughs> Going up against Heath Herring. Herring coming off a tremendous win by choke out over Tom Erickson, a man that most people in the sport thought could not be beaten. Yep. Yep, 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 yep. But as you can see, everybody is beatable. Yeah, Heath Herring coming in uh, somewhere around the 250 pound range. Ensign right around 210, 209, touching gloves. Uh, how is Ensign going to get Heath Herring down, boss? I don't know. I don't know what his game plan is. We heard he went to uh, Thailand for Thai boxing. He was looking sharp. Hard no counter. He should, he should strike first. You know, Ensign's coming out, throwing some bombs here. A lot of pressure here by Ensign and Oe. Oh, nice oh, no, punch. No. Oh. Takedown there by Heath Herring. You know, Ensign came out with a warrior spirit. Oh, yeah, I, but I think I think uh, he slipped there. I don't know if it was a real hit. I, I couldn't see. And there he goes, Kimura. Oh. Got, got, it. got the key lock there, the Americana, out of the side mount. That is the position you want to be in. He's got to flatten his body. Lay down, he has to go flat on him. He has to push his hand towards the legs, push it down. I got, I hope he doesn't wear himself out trying for this, but he's also going to wear Ensign out a little bit, trying to defend the move. Okay, step your right foot over Ensign's face. He has to step over his head now and then totally try to twist. Uh, he should slide that hand from the right to the left over the ground. There. No, he's pulling it up. He should go lower. Yeah, he should keep his left elbow down on the mat. At this point, if he knows he can't get it, should he give it up? Should he give it up? Yes, I think so. And there he did. He gave it up. Oh, God. I thought Heath Herring said to the judge, I'm going to break it. I mean, he's going to break it. But I think Anson, look at the size of his arms. He got, he's flexible and he's strong. So he did a good defense right there. He should have, yeah, again, he should have slid it over the ground. So it's the legs of Anson. That would have been now it. Heath is going to stand back up. And he's going to say, let's get back up. Let's trade. Ensign kind of dropping that right arm. That right arm might be a little tired now, boss. Oh, a good kick. Bush kick there by Ensign. It's going to be hard for Ensign to throw that right hand now because he's had to fight off a key lock from Heath Herring. And Herring oh. down on top in the guard. Uh, and he's going for the armbar already. Watch it. Ensign's going. Oops. Heath keeping his face up real high. His, his uh, forehead down low into the chest in order to avoid a submission from the bottom. Now, Anson has had success and failure from the bottom guard position. He's been stopped before uh, in the guard while he was on the bottom, but he's also been successful with Armand, as we said before, uh, with Couture and Royce Alger. He's chopping away to that right side of Anson's, uh, the, 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 the right hand of Anson's body. And it's very smart, and suddenly he will make a high punch. Hook to the head. Coming down with the back fist there, and chopping it away again with that right hand. You know, Heath is looking up every once in a while at Anson to see if he's still got the fight left in him, and he sure does. But Heath is all business right here. He's doing a great job. But, you know, if he does, if that goes on bar, Attempt. But uh, Heath stacking up high, almost passing the guard. Oh, yeah, he is, he, he's very good at submissions. Yeah, well, he's choked out a few people and armbarred a few people. He's uh, choked out Evan Tanner with a rear naked choke, same move he used against Tom Erickson. And uh, he's hammer locked Sean McCulley. He's key locked some people. You're a gape. 
They was in uh, Colorado in uh, the Boston Invitational. I met him there. He won that tournament. You know, I think Heath is a really good student of the game. Came in primarily from a wrestling background. Went to Holland, learned some Muay Thai, got some submissions, pretty much turning into a complete fight. And now look, he's getting side control again. Could want to stand back up here. Oh, Knee now, to the head. Yeah, now he's gonna go. He is he is strong. He's got a very good base. Knee to the head again. The knee, that knee those the are hard again. knees, boss. Yes. Hard knees. He's not gonna want to take a lot of those. <laughs> he's knee to the body. He is introducing himself. The fight is over. Looks like the referee has stopped the fight from repeated punishment. Wow, Keith Herring in control from the top, side mount position, dropping knee after knee onto the head of Ensign Inoue. Ensign's not real happy with the decision. But I think it was a, you know, he was he was not defending. All the knees were a hit. And the referee said, you know, this is a sport. That's not taken to the extreme. Extreme. Go home and 